Hey, well, hello to everyone out there in YouTube land. I hope that everybody is doing well. I'm doing pretty good, just involving myself in a lot of weekend shenanigans and whatnot. I've uh, been running around and doing this, that, and the other, and I'm trying to wind down now. I'm just getting ready to, um, I'm just warming up some leftovers now, just some beans and rice and um, some chicken and fish, I guess. Um, so anyway, um, I went to Aldi. Well, actually, I went to Aldi like a week ago or so, and I picked up these chips. And I know I'm always late, so you probably are already on to these chips. Uh, horse, uh, horseradish cheddar. Oh, my goodness. I picked up one. I said, oh, let me just try them. And, oh, my goodness, I got them home, and I was like, oh. They were tingling in my nose and my nostrils and whatnot. You know, that spiciness. Oh, it was just beautiful. I was like, oh, I got to go back and get some of these. And I went to a couple of couple of the uh, locations nearby and they didn't have them. Like, we're already, we're out of those, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, because then they, somebody said, one of the uh, associates said, oh, those have been gone or something like that. So well, I don't know, you know, but nonetheless, I went to a, the the Audi that I originally found them, and and I found them. Actually, only it was only one sitting in the box, and I was like, oh, this can't be. And I was like, okay, well, Lord, I'm thankful for this one back uh, bag because I did go online to see, um, you know, if they're, you know, if this where did this exist or whatever, and I did find them. You know, not Clancy's, of course, but I saw care or hair or whatever, here's, hers, whatever. And um, and somebody, another, you know, somebody else makes the flavor. So I was like, oh, well, good. So I said, thank at least you, I said, thank God for this, this one bag anyway, Lord. And then I, I walked around and looked up the, I looked down the aisle a little bit more and these hiding, sitting, stacked up on top of each other and hiding. I said, okay, Lord, thank you. <laughs> so I got three of these and I know I was off of chips for a while, but I'm back on them. Uh, I do love my chips or things to use with hummus, although I probably won't make these, um, use hummus for these, of course. Uh, nah, but, uh, but they, they are really, really good. Good with sandwiches, on sandwiches, you know, stuff like that or whatever. So anyway, I got three bags of these and I said, well, then, like I said, these were stacked. So they were stacked with this. So I was like, because I was looking for the, the top of the, I knew what the bag looked like. Oh, is that gluten-free? Okay. So I, I said, oh, okay. Um, so I said, oh, well, you know, these are buffalo uh, blue cheese. I said, well, I'm probably not, I'm probably not going to like these. <laughs> but I picked them up anyway. And I picked up two just in case I like them. <laughs> I'm like, let me get a couple of these. Well, this is all they had anyway. These are all, I think these were all of the the blue cheese the buffalo blue cheese and this was definitely the only three of these left but again they have that flavor and i don't think i've ever well i think i've seen buffalo blue cheese because i think jay's not jay's um is it no lay excuse me because i think lay's has this but this is so oh i love that horse oh my goodness i love horse radish anyway and it's like oh my goodness this is so 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 good so i picked up two of those these are i like these uh, but i'm i was thinking that these are probably even because these just blew my mind i was just like let me just pick these up i know I, these are plain i eat you know eat these every now and again because i like the jalapeno uh, anyway chips so i said let me just pick up one of these anyway just for the sake of everything so anyway yep yeah, back on chips again um and but i'm um yeah back on chips again so anyway but this is the problem though you look at this, this bag just the just you know it looks so ravaged because of the foil or whatever that they're using now that's one thing i don't like because it's hard to keep it because I like to fold my bags in, take a few out, fold the bag in. So you'll just wind up having to exchange this and put this into a 
uh, zip, you know, Ziploc or plastic container, whatever you use, glass container or whatever. But hold on, let me show you what else, uh, since I'm here, let me show you what else um, I want to recommend. Okay, so we eat plantain chips, sweet and salty, but my goodness, well, I kind of don't eat them like I used to anyway. But I, I say, you know what, because I was at Whole Food and I was somewhere and I just needed a little snack. I said, well, let me pick up. I was getting ready to go home or, or out doing something. I said, well, let me get me a little snack. And I said, oh, well, did, no, I take that back. I was looking for, I think I was looking for my heritage blend. I was looking for my heritage blend and I couldn't find it. But, um, so that's what happened. I was looking for my heritage blend. And I said, oh, they got plantain. I said, oh, sea salt. Oh, made with coconut. All of those those three. I said, oh, let me try them. And they are so, so good. So they're just perfect. Like a lot of the other bags or a lot of the other brands you buy, you, they're kind of like a hit and miss situation. These are so excellent. So perfect. Love the 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 to consist the uh, shape or the um, what do you call it? Di I want to say diameter, but that's not what I mean. The thinness, uh, the is it? Uh, I can't remember what you call it, but anyway, the um, this. <laughs> anyway, they're just so delicious, though. Everything about them is so so delicious. But yeah, I was looking for my heritage blend, and that is uh, as a matter of fact. Uh, what was I going to say? But anyway, so I was looking for my heritage heritage blend. So I picked picked those up, and uh, you can see the different potatoes and the beets because I love these beets. I've go I have grown these two years in a row uh, without uh, any success, or they might be in the ground. Those those particular beets, anyway. And I just have the Exotic Harvest. I love the red, white, and blue as well. I haven't had that in a so, so many years. But still, the I'm, I'm even, I just have, as a matter of fact, somebody just gave me some seeds. Uh, is it for one of these? Yeah, I think so. For the kabocha. Um, uh, what do you call it? Um, squash, too. And then these are carrots and naturally blue um, pota uh, potatoes. So, yeah. So, these are just some little snacks that I like to have. You can have, you know, don't use your dips or your hummuses or whatever. But, yeah, I just wanted to. Oh, these were so good. The consistency, the taste, the you know, the flavor. Um, everything was just proper, you know, the, um, the cut of it. Yeah, it's the cut. That's the word I was looking for. <laughs> I need to go eat y'all I need to go eat but anyway I'll talk to you guys later love you very much um uh yeah so I love you very much and I'll talk to you guys later let me know also do have you tried these and are you willing to try them <laughs> which ones have you tried these look like these are gonna be good I'm gonna just taste these just taste them before I eat my dinner. I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to taste them because I'm just interested. I love blue cheese, but man, this horse radish. Ooh. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Let me know if you have tried these. Either one, try, if you've tried any of them, oh, if you have tried any of them, or what's your favorite Terra uh, chips? Because I know there are so many flavors of them. Uh, so let me know which ones are your favorite. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye for now.